from prison. He's set to appear before a Nevada parole board this afternoon uh, by a video link from the Lovelock Correctional Center. Simpson has served nine years of his 30-year sentence. He was convicted of kidnapping, armed robbery, and assault with a deadly weapon in a dispute over some sports memorabilia. It all happened at a hotel room in Vegas. If he's granted parole, Simpson could be released as early as October 1st. So what exactly are the chances that he gets parole? Well, we spoke with a member of my legal dream team, Latonya Hines. Here's what she had to say. He's been a model prisoner. He hasn't had to be in solitary confinement. There haven't been any issues with him. And then based off of his criminal history, too, if you've got to remember that, too, just because he was, a, um, he was tried for murder, he wasn't convicted of murder. And so looking at his past criminal history, looking at his behavior in um, prison, and then looking at the term that he was given, I think that you say, yes, he would definitely be eligible for parole, and that he would be walking out. Uh, I agree, and, and the DA in the case also agrees that OJ will likely get parole and probably should get parole based upon Nevada law and his prior criminal history, which doesn't exist except for this case. It's, it's convictions that count, not being arrested, not being charged, but actual convictions. Big hearing today. You'll see it streaming on 11alive.com. It'll also be on television. I think ESPN is actually planning on covering this whole thing live.